King, your girl, the real deal, Anita Gill. You know, I found some video. I don't know how I got to this page, y'all. I don't know how did my video get to this page. But I want y'all to see this because I wasn't watching this. I was watching Ashley. But somehow I got to this page. But let's talk about it. Let's talk about these pages. These are the three boys that, do you remember that uh, the detective stopped? Stop them. There's these three guys. Okay. But they trying to say yellow hoodie in it. Okay, let's go to the next video. People, people have found. People have found. Sorry, I'm talking to Twitch. And that's the camera. Something about that car. They said two fifty eight and three fourteen out. So they went in at three fifty eight and came out at three fourteen. We I don't know how I got this video. Saturday, like Buy the camera. 
Round of Put penalties. Of those three boys, then the same three boys they caught. Saw it first. They said the food truck again. Hold on, let me see. Can I get you out? See it. Hold on, y'all. Let me see. Come back, clear this up for y'all. Because I just found this on Tip that. I don't know who put it out there. Now, I don't remember seeing these people at the uh, truck. A self a bit boy over there. I don't know. Somebody put the, uh, sending a message, y'all. It's saying that they saying where you get your drugs from. I don't know, but we heard them say, she said, what did you tell Jack? You know what? I wonder. Uh, this was two days ago. Somebody record this. Somebody put this out here on TikTok two days ago. I don't know who did it. But this at the food truck. But I don't see Kaylee them in this picture. But I remember that girl. Kaylee them supposed to be over here at the truck. Now, I'm going to stop it on these guys. Hold on. Who it is? Is that Jack? I don't know. I don't know, Jack. Hmm. And that's all I got, y'all. And this was two days ago on TikTok. So I don't know how I got to this page. But this person right here had it up there. And I don't know how it's, this is interesting when I got to this. When I got right here, I remember them three boys. They stopped them three boys leaving the, uh, the thing. And then right here on this video, they trying to say... Kaylee didn't ask him what they think they're asking for. But I don't know. And at this truck right here, at the food truck, we didn't see all this. I know that boy in the yellow shirt walking around. Absolutely, thank you. How are you doing? I'm doing extremely well. But I don't know this. I don't remember the boy in the yellow uh, jacket. But I remember that girl. And I don't see Kaylee and I don't see. If we 
if we decide yeah. to, since we let's so go. So people, yeah. people have fallen. People have fallen over the reduce for you. Sorry, I'm talking to a stranger. Oh, you're so good. Now, I got this after I came from here. I don't even know how I got here. Because I didn't even put this in. I didn't put this in at all. I was watching uh, Ashley. I was watching Ashley, and then that came up. That was weird. Get her alcohol from Get alcohol Why would they put this on TikTok? But I'm curious. I'm going to go right back to this for one more second. They trying to say that Kayla said something different. If we decide yeah. to, since we let's go. Oh, people, people have fallen. People have found out the for you. Sorry. So I got a question, y'all. Absolutely. Thank you. Is this the real video at the uh extremely well? That sounds good. At the food truck that they caught before uh, the girls got there or what? Hold on, I'm trying to take it. And kind of think of it. Hold on. Okay, it won't let me show y'all. People, people have found. People have found. Oh, sorry, I'm talking to a stranger. Oh, you're so good. Absolutely, thank you. Get her alcohol from this case. I don't remember jacket, yellow hoodie. Uh, but I'm gonna be it, boy. Now, who are these boys? Y'all, I don't know how I got here. I don't know. I was looking at Ashley Page and it flipped me here. I guess they wanted me to see it. I don't know. But it's nothing else on here. It's nothing else on here. And they got another one where the police caught the... Uh... I don't need to know what's going on. Somebody tried to edit the videos. Yeah, somebody tried to edit these videos. Somebody edit these videos right here. And I don't know how I got here. I don't. I don't know where these videos come from. Somebody edit these videos and put them right here for a reason. And I don't know who did it. But I'm going to put this up here because that was up there. I was here. I was listening to Ashley. And he switched me over to here. That was crazy. Because I don't know who page that is. Tampa, sit down. I'm on live, okay? <laughs> 
How long, y'all? Cause they pulled, they pulled her videos. <laughs> now I don't know, I don't know what's going on, but I was on Ashley Page. Be nice, Camper. Like I have physical evidence, I guess it's like a smoking that validates everything that I've said about her, but I can't speak on it now because it has to wait for court. So hopefully court doesn't take too long. Like I have physical evidence of the uh, I wanted to show y'all something else Ashley put on here. Uh, somebody been putting, she claimed that allegedly saying somebody is putting fake information on her. Hold on, y'all. Investigators have been combating a lot of misinformation on this case, but they say this, this claim that this professor is somehow involved in the murder is perhaps the most high profile, as it has been shared online millions of times. A University of Idaho professor is suing the so-called internet sleuth for defamation after the TikTok personality posted a series of videos accusing, without any credible evidence, that the professor was somehow tied to the November murders of four college students. According to the lawsuit, TikToker Ashley Gillard posted six videos claiming Professor Rebecca Schofield was responsible for the four students' deaths. The suit says the videos have been viewed. Professor at the school is suing a TikTok user who claims she was responsible. Lola Lange joins us with the latest. Lola, good morning. Well, good morning, Janae. For weeks, investigators have been combating a lot of misinformation on this case. But they say this, this claim that this professor is somehow involved in the murder is perhaps the most high profile as it has been shared online millions of times. A University of Idaho professor is suing the so-called internet sleuth for defamation after the TikTok personality posted a series of videos accusing, without any credible evidence, that the professor was somehow tied to the November murders of four college students. According to the lawsuit, TikToker Ashley Giller posted six videos claiming Professor Rebecca Schofield was responsible for the four students' deaths. The suit says the videos have been viewed. Professor at the school is suing a TikTok user who claims she was responsible. Lola Lange joins us with the latest Lola Good Morning. Okay, now, I was watching this and all of a sudden, this switch off. I can't, yeah, okay. Okay, this other stuff. I went on this page, y'all. I was on another page of Ash. Hold on, I know where I was right here. This is where I was. Listen to Ashley. Ashley says, "Stands on what you say." Stand on it. 
And some of it I say so that I can make you stand on it. But YouTube, news and articles, the comments, TikTok videos, whatever. When the truth comes out and you say that I'm right, I just want you guys to leave that stuff up and stand on what you said. Don't believe it and try to bandwagon. Stand on it. And some of it I say so that I can make you stand on it. Okay, Ashley, you got a lot out there, baby. They delete a lot of her videos. Well, I got that. They deleted a lot of her videos. And And you know, it's it's I hate to see a situation like this happen because I can imagine how she how Ashley feel and I hope Ashley can imagine how uh Rebecca feels, the professor feel at this time, you know. They feel the same way. You know, it, it's sad. It really is. Well, we did that. So somehow, when y'all get a chance, go back and watch the video that I just showed y'all at the food truck. I don't know how in the world did this video skip to there, and I don't even know them people. It, so when you get a chance, it'll show you a video of the young man in the yellow jacket, the yellow hoodie. And I don't remember seeing a, young, a, a yellow hoodie and they was trying to say allegedly that uh I, allegedly i i don't remember seeing no they we didn't see a video with the uh with the yellow hoodie we didn't see that video so i i don't know i don't know how that happened i don't know how i got to that page but i was on here and it switched out to that page and that, I don't know why my, I told y'all my my uh, videos will do that. It'll switch. It seems like somebody giving me a, somebody doing, sending it to me. But go back and check the video that I just showed y'all. Because I can't even go back to it. Cause, let me see. Hold on. Uh-uh. It's not going back. Hold on. Mm -mm. At the school is suing a TikTok user who claims she it's not going back. I don't even know how I got to where I was with that other video. It came on my uh, page. It came on my page, and, and I don't know how I, how I got on here, but I can't go back and show y'all. So, uh... They took a lot of uh, they took a lot of Ashley's pages down, but when y'all get a chance, I want y'all to come in to the food truck situation in my video uh, in this video right here. Uh, they allegedly trying whoever put that video out. I want y'all. I can't go back to it. I don't even know how I got there because I don't know those people and. It took me there. And um, it showed the police. I wonder why did it do that, though. It showed the police conversation. Uh, what is that saying? I don't know. That's weird. And they trying to say in the video that I have that um, they trying to say in the video the one that I that I was watching that they got three guys they changed they edited to me 
I don't know how the boy and they edit. Did somebody they edit the video or those were the real videos? I don't know because I wasn't there. But it was the video inside. Uh, it was like at the food truck. You got, I didn't see on this video that I found, y'all, today uh, on here. Uh, so go back and watch this video on this on this uh, live and uh, tell me what y'all think because I've been following this case from day one and at that food truck, this seemed like before they got to the food truck. Looked like somebody took a before video uh after video but the the big guy who we call uh the big guy and then we call the other guy lumberjack they was there and the girl who was talking to lumberjack them i didn't see kaylee and um kaylee and uh what her name um uh, maddie maddie at the uh food truck so i said now who edited the video so in this video that I have today, that this content that I'm doing today, somebody edited some video, y'all. Somebody knew what they were doing when they did it. Because there's no way I got on a page that I don't be on. And I don't understand how I got there. Because I didn't do nothing. I was watching Ashley and then it just flipped to something, not this, but it went to... Even it, it showed a recording of the police officer when they, when they stopped the three boys walking who say they stay in the neighborhood and they let them go uh and then in one of one of the, uh, the videos show um the camera moving yeah the camera moving around i don't know it's weird i don't know how i got there I can't even explain to y'all. I can't even go back. I can't even go back to where it was. I ain't never seen It wasn't none of this. It wasn't this. Mm, what's going on? And they had, like I said, they has taken down a lot of, um, I, I, I'm kind of glad they took down some of uh, Ashley's pages for her good, for her sake. Uh, I'm kind of glad they, they, they took it down. You know, they took a lot of them down. Yeah. I think that's it right here on this. And for her sake, I'm glad, you know. These just the regular pages. Oh yeah, they don't clear extra page. And on this one, on her page right. Hold on. See all these different pages. Ashley had a lot of, she had like a million or some, and they took that from her. Um, and I think I went in one of these. Let me see, I went in there and let me see. You can't, you can't get in this one, that's a, you can't get in this page, either in a fake page or a new page. Uh, you can't get in this one. Usually when you can't get on a page like this, it either private. So that means that I can't get in it. See, I can't get in it, so in a way that's kind of good. And these are fake. I've 
but I can't speak on it now because it has. Okay, this is her new page, allegedly. This is Ashley's new page. Uh, this is the old page. I thought they said they took this page down on the news. Her page is still up. That's crazy. The news said that her page was taken up. Her page still here. Y'all see it. Ashley Pace is still up. Why would they say they delete her account? The news said they delete her account. And her account is still up. You see? This is her account. They go to millions. Like I said, she got a million likes. Y'all see it. Her page is still up. Why do they think her page is down? Why did they tell people that the page was down and it's up? Well, we're looking at it. And we know it's her because 2.6 million. Oh, we did that. The police were going to be arresting a person who was. But this is crazy. She got a she got a TikTok page, y'all. But I can go back and show you what it is. This is where somebody was throwing her. Ashley Page is still up. Oh, her page, oh, her page is still here. And right here, y'all just saw it on the news that they took the page down. <laughs> this is crazy. They <laughs> they giving false information to them people. Wow, that is crazy. Oh, like wow. I have physical evidence against Rebecca Schofield that validates everything that I've said about her, but this I can't is crazy. speak on it now because it has to wait for court, so. Her page is... It was three days ago. This is good. Oh, let me go. Hold up. See these fake pages. But the news, see, I can't get on these. But let me go back to what the news said, and I was on her channel. Ashley got Ashley got her page. I can't even get it. Well, okay, okay. She got her page. She have a page. A page not deleted. I'm trying to find the news. Got the news said the face. The page was deleted, and it's still here. Why did the news tell y'all that the page was deleted and it's not? It's still here. It's crazy. I don't know what's going on. See, her yeah, page still up. Even by, by the lady, the teacher, it's still in there. So they didn't, this, it didn't disappear. Let me see something. I hope this right here stop. I don't want to see no nobody, you know, upset in this case. I just want them to focus on the girl, the kids. 
Oh boy, I can't even find what I'm looking for. They won't even let me out of here. Oh. Let me do this. For filing for a lawsuit against me from Rebecca Schofield, I'm not stopping, so let's just start there. But I don't know, yeah, let me see some. Right here. See, listen to what the news said right here. Professor at the school is suing a TikTok user who claims she was responsible. Well, Elaine joins us with the latest. Mo, good morning. Well, good morning, Janae. For weeks, investigators have been combating a lot of misinformation on this case. But they say this, this claim that this professor is somehow involved in the murder is perhaps the most high profile as it has been shared online millions of times. A University of Idaho professor is suing a so-called internet sleuth for defamation after the TikTok personality posted a series of videos accusing, without any credible evidence, that the professor was somehow tied to the November murders of four college students. According to the lawsuit, TikToker Ashley Giller posted six videos claiming Professor Rebecca Schofield was responsible for the four students' deaths. The suit says the videos have been viewed. Professor at the school is suing... Oh, a mute. Oh, they mute. Okay, y'all. They didn't take the page down. They mute the page. Hold on. So, let's get it right. Let's correct that. They did not take the page. They mute information that she had on there about the... Uh, let's see. Can we find it? They mute the page. So... Ugh. Let me find. Let me find the one that they mute. Let's see. Can we find the ones that they mute? Okay. I tell you what. Hold on. His name is they should have mute this one. Okay. So y'all, that's it. I just wanted y'all to come in and um see what I had put back. Go back in now and look at the other information, the new information on this video right here. Y'all like, share, and subscribe. This is your girl, the real deal, Lenita Gill. I'm out.